Hey Fixers, this is Aaron Humphrey with RumorFix.com. We caught up with the cast of Party Down South. Here's what Walt had to say. You seem like one of the most level-headed people in the house. Um, why do you think that is, and how do you feel about you know being the most level-headed? Um, I'm not sure. I mean, I'm, I'm I am who I am, and they are who they are, and you know I'm not acting any different than I am when I'm at home or when I'm on a TV show. Okay, and because your behavior is a little bit more tame, do you kind of, what do you think about the rest of the cast behavior, like Lyle getting into fights, getting super drunk? <laughs> well, it is a little bit different, you know. Uh, the way I, what I do when I go out, you know, I like to dance, I like to drink a little bit, you know. My style might be a little bit different than theirs, you know. I don't know, maybe, uh, just by chance, maybe I happen to be a little bit more mature in some different areas, you know. It is, it's, it's different. So, you know, I am, you know, they, they do their thing. So. Most of the time, I don't even know what they're doing. <laughs> so I'm too busy trying to find me a cute girl out there somewhere, you know. Yeah. Uh, you said in episode four that you're a changed man. What does that mean, and how are you a changed man? <clears throat> well, when I was younger, I made a few mistakes, as we all did. You know, kids do, do tend to make mistakes. But, you know, in the real world, you know, it takes a man to be able to clean it up. Mm-hmm. What kind of mistakes? Uh, I'd rather not say. And can, you, can you talk about any of them? Give us a little hint. Uh, let's just say that drinking hasn't always, you know, been a great thing to do. Okay. Okay. So any run-ins with the law from the past or anything like that? Yeah, a couple, a couple run-ins with the law. Okay. And you're you're kind of changed in that regards then. You're a little more tamed. (laughs) All right. Now, how does it feel that you guys might become bigger than Jersey Shore? I know lots of the media is saying that and comparing you guys to that show. I have... I really don't know anything about Jersey Shore, okay. or I really don't know anything about TV for that matter, because okay. I've actually never had cable. So I didn't really start watching TV until like this started coming out. And like a lot of my friends don't know anything about TV either, but then now they, they, they watch the show because I'm on it, but now like they love the show. Okay. So I really don't know how to answer that. Well, each cast member, at, you know, at their peak, they were making like millions of dollars, so they were huge. What, how does that make you feel that you could potentially become that and you know become a millionaire? I don't know if you already are, but <laughs> woo. Uh-huh. Well, the way I look at it is, I gave up on my first million, so I'm working on my second one now. Oh. So uh, I don't know. It you know, money is not everything to me. You know, experience is everything. But you know, if if I do happen to be able to be a millionaire, mm-hmm. wonderful. Okay, so then, do you know anything about, you know, there are reports that you guys were demanding more money before filming any other episode. Do you know anything about that? Is that true? I have no idea anything about really? the more mo- the more money thing. I did hear something about that, but I really don't. I don't know anything about that. Okay, so you're not demanding more money. You're negative. <laughs> <laughs>